Hey everybody, Edmund Dane here, and I'd like to welcome you to my playthrough of Power Drill Massacre. Now, this is an alpha game developed by Puppet Combo. A link to their website will be in the description below. I've heard it's very scary. I have not... I'm kind of nervous, but we're going to get into it and see how things go. Okay, so apparently this game is supposed to be sort of an homage to the 70s slasher flicks. Um, I do enjoy those movies, so... I'm very excited about this game. Did it say the Phillies beat the Dodgers three to nothing? Yeah. Home team. Jeff, are you okay? Uh, can't feel my legs. Don't worry, Jeff. I'll go get help. This is the worst headache ever, but I think I'm all right. It's getting dark. Better get the flashlight out of the trunk. My flashlight! Pick it up. Uh... Really? I guess, I guess it really is like Resident Evil. Like, you desperately need this item, and your character just said that they're going to get it. Would you like to pick it up? Okay. Oh, they got that whole... Oh, man, this is... This is pretty sweet, actually. It really does have that VHS feel. I, I, I like this. This is awesome. Okay. And it's got that Resident Evil feel right down to the really crappy camera angles. Okay. Whoa. Oh, it's very loud in my ears. Okay, we're finally here! Wow, that took forever. Oh god. This door is open. Go inside? Is, is no an option? What happens if you say no? It. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I clicked no, but okay. I can't leave yet. I gotta find help for Jeff. Oh god. Oh shit, man. Oh, there ain't gonna be any help here, man. Like doors unlocking and shit. Okay, there's the flashlight. Let's do a little bit of explore. Oh my goodness, this is. I'm trying to figure out which camera's better. Neither. If we were just a little further back, it would be so much better. Oh, gee. Oh, shit, man. Could you stop with the... With the shit? Oh, God. Ooh. Looks like an article ripped out of a newsplate paper. Newsplaper. Out of a newsplaper. Read it. Yes. The search continues for two missing campers in the Pocono Mountains. Wow, this is real close to home. Mason C., Sergeant, and Laurie Summers of Long Island, New York have been missing. Since June 8th, their campsite and belongings have been located, but investigators have few leads. Police say there are no visible signs of a struggle, and this... continues to be a rescue mission. The rest is missing. It's dated August 1982, five years ago. Okay, so we're in 87. Ugh. I'm going back the way I came. Oh, God. This is like an Illuminati. Oh, what is this? Looks like a key. Pick it up. You got a key with red paint splatter on it. Red paint. Yeah. Yeah. Red paint. Oh, God. What's going to kill me now? Oh, there's something shiny over there. That looks like a key. Okay, so I've got two keys. Blue, blue paint key. I've got two keys and no doors that need unlocking. Ugh. My terrible navigation skills. Haunt me again. Oh my god, I can't... I can't... My brain can't process the having to do this while doing this because you don't turn in a traditional sense like you hit left and you do this little spin thing I guess you could like strafe Ugh. 
It's like basically you just you probably shouldn't be running. Maybe that's the problem. But of course it's a horror game, so it's, oh my god, what the fuck was that? Oh shit! What the fuck was that? gonna go through all that again no what the hell was that do I at least have the keys still holy shit that was so loud okay it's a locked metal door there's a murderer in here goddamn murderer The lock metal door, I feel like I'm being watched here. Oh, well, that's... Yeah, yeah, you are. What the hell? With grime. No key. A greasy old toilet. Not just, you know, any old dirty toilet, but greasy. Our man is eating too much McDonald's. Well, wait. Okay, if this were a normal house where I could get some help... Wouldn't it be, like, not in this state of disrepair? Oh, God, please don't fucking blow out my ears again. I might have to turn this down. That is really loud. That is deafening. Literally damaging my eardrums when I hear that. Okay, so we're back here. Looks like a key. Pick it up. You got a key with green paint splattered on it. Okay, so we just need to find all the freaking keys? I don't know. Oh god, that's a... Why am I doing this? Why am I doing this to myself? Oh god, what the hell what the hell's going on? Oh no, we're in a fucking basement. Oh, this is just great. I don't think you're going to find help for your friend Jeff here. Oh, uh, wow, you just can't see anything. Surprise! Oh, shit! <laughs> I was surprised. Oh, my heart can't take it. Oh, bad heart's running my family. I'm going to die. Okay, so the keys are back where they were, and I just didn't find this one. Key, pick it up. Okay. We got the key again. I don't really hear anything, and I have the volume pretty well turned up. I mean, maybe I don't have... Okay. So maybe those sounds mean that somebody's coming and I should, like, turn off the flashlight and or hide? I don't know if the guy took the time out of his, like, busy day to write surprise on that wall because he knew I was coming, or if it was just there the whole time and he's just, like, waiting for you to go into that room. But that was ridiculous. It's like he knew. Maybe I should be listening so I don't die. Oh, shit. Oh, no, something's coming. Should I turn around? Is turning around bad? It's kind of like Five Nights at Freddy's in the, in the scare department, right? Like, you just, you're terrified of, of dying because of the ridiculous jump scare. And I feel like I'm just walking around in circles here, but... Oh god, what the fuck was that? Did you, did you see that shit? Can I get a key to this door? It's locked? Somebody locked me in? Yes, somebody locked you. Oh god, I'm fucking screwed. It wasn't that shocking before, but now that it, you know... Oh, God. Hide. Hide. 
Hide. Doesn't look like a greasy old toilet. Oh god. <laughs> and I don't want to die here. I hear like wind and shit. This is not fucking funny, man. This sound is so loud. It like blows out your eardrums. Please don't kill me. Mr. Jason with a power drill. Jason Borhees. Ha 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 ha. I don't want to die. No. No, please. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit, man! No, not the blaring noise again! Fuck! Can we go up the stairs, maybe? The door is locked. There are three locks with splotches of paint. Blue, green, and red. Oh, so that's what the keys are for! Okay. Oh, that's a sound. I heard sounds. Oh, shit. Take it like a man. Am I going backwards? I don't know where the hell I'm going at all. I'm just so lost. Don't power drill me, bro! I'm just trying to help my friend. Why are you killing me? I don't even know if you can escape the guy. I just, every time I see him, I just get so fucking panicked. This game seems pretty cool if you like to get the shit scared out of you a few times. Oh god. That asshole's coming. Can we turn off the flashlight and hide from this son of a bitch? Fuck, man. Fuck me! No! I'm going to die a horrible death, I know it! I feel like I'm being watched here! Ew! Please don't kill me. Please, I'm, I'm your friend. Ooh, another, another newspaper article, read it? Yes. Pocono Vanishings. No trace of missing campers. April 4th, 1985. Since 1978, 12 campers have disappeared over a 100-mile stretch of the Pocono Mountains. We conduct dozens of research... We conduct dozens of rescue missions each year, says park ranger Charlie Plank. People come up here to camp and hike all the time without any experience. Accidents happen. While most rescues are successful, these 12 have stumped park rangers and local police. Campfires left burning, boots and jackets left behind, radio still playing. It's like these people were ripped away from their campsite, says Abe Bradley, Abe Bradley, who was involved in the search for... I can't read anymore, the ink has faded. My reading skills are terrible today. Abe Bradley. Bradley Cooper. Oh god, that wind shit. Yeah. These I just wanna I just wanted to have a good time. I just wanted to get help from my friend Jeff. We were going on our honeymoon. We were going to We were going to have a beautiful honeymoon at a lodge in the Poconos and now we're in this fucking mess. Excellent female voices. Can't tell the difference. Well, we're going into the basement to die. Cause why the fuck not? Oh, great cornered. Yeah. Well, it's open. Yeah. Ah, oh, please don't kill me. Oh God. Like, I can't even navigate without having to run from a vicious murderer. <laughs> There's no way I'm getting away from this guy if he spots me. Oh god, got that VHS sort of stutter going there. Oh god, does that mean he's gonna come to kill me? Does that mean he's here? Oh. I 
don't want the loud noise in my ear. I, I, I cannot stand the loud noise. But this shit? It's a shortwave radio. Too bad there's no electricity. If they're reading about murders and shit in the mountains, don't you think you would just get the fuck out of here and just be like, Well, let's take a few mile jog and see if there's another house. Oh god, fucking shit flashing in my face. I don't like this. No, not surprise again. I don't want a surprise. I don't want a surprise. Please, no surprise. Oh god, something's coming. God, I don't want it. Oh, come on, just fucking kill me already and get my misery over with. I don't know where I'm going at all. Where the f I know I'm supposed to find keys. Am I even supposed to be in this basement at all? Is there anything here that I need? Can we just get the hell out of this basement? Go back up the stairs? Don't kill me, please! Please, leave me alone. He's around. He's, he's screwing with me. He knows exactly where I am. He's just screwing with me. I heard him! I don't want to go anywhere! Oh, he's coming. He's gonna get me. No! I just have no clue where I'm going. Like, how is this graffiti getting on the wall? Who is sneaking into this place to put graffiti on the wall? Sugar tunnel? No! I don't want to go down a sugar tunnel. I don't want to go down the sugar tunnel. Fuck, man, I just don't want that blaring noise in my ear again. Fine, fucking sugar tunnel, come on. Come get me, sugar. Oh, God. I feel like this is not going to be very sweet. Where the hell is this guy? He seems to be very content with letting me walk around his place. And for a vicious murder, I haven't seen any bodies. It was just a factory with a power drill weird wielding maniac ready to jump down my throat at a moment's notice. Okay, well that sounds back tack. Back fucking tack. Oh shit! Oh my gosh! The fucking noise! It's fucking oh. Oh. Okay. Okay, I can't. I, it just fucking makes me freeze up, and then I can't do anything. Oh my god. Well, it's good to know I wouldn't last five seconds in a house with a murderer, because I would just be terrified. Oh my. All right, we are back. Now, the jump scares in this game were so intense that they literally blew my shirt off of my body and disintegrated it, so I had to get a new one. And they aged me by about two weeks, so, you know, longer hair and all that. But, of course, we don't have gray hair because we don't get gray hair from time travel. What do I look like? Fucking Cable? Ah, we're Marty McFly, and nobody calls me chicken. Let's get back into this. Oh, God, I heard something already. Oh, God, I hate this fucking game. God, what the fuck was that? I heard him. I heard him. Oh, God. Oh, it's the death tunnels again. Is that footsteps? Not a surprise again. Oh, shit! What? No! What the? Oh, it ain't getting any easier, folks. It really is not. Shit, man. No, please. Please, give me a fucking break, man. Can't ruin the atmosphere. Oh, shit, no! 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 I heard him! Oh, God. No! Where the hell am I going? Oh, God. Is it gonna be surprise again? Oh, God. It's surprise room! 
No, why am I here? There's no keys here! There's no healing for Jeff here! Damn it! Why are we here? There could be... You got a better shot fucking finding herbs in the forest! Oh god, that's a... Oh god. Oh god, that's a dead end! My glutes are so clenched right now, I'm getting such an exercise. That footsteps? Why does it gotta be so loud, man? That's like not even right. It's so unfair. Oh god. The wind creeps you out. You know it's a good atmosphere when the wind makes you scared. The wind probably means nothing. Oh, the graffiti. <laughs> oh, shit! No! There's nothing! There's nothing to let you know where you can go or what you can do! I heard if you turn on the flashlight, well, you can walk through walls! Broken! Oh god, that was him. Oh god, that was him. He's around here somewhere! Of course he is, he's trying to kill me. He's really trying to drill the point into me. Oh god! Hide in the corner. Turn the light out. Oh god. Oh god. He's down there, man. He's slamming doors and shit. When he wants to show up, he just kind of shows up and pretty much nothing I can do but shit a whole house. Oh shit, no! Got some creepy fucking music going on. Oh god, surprise. Is this is a surprise area. No, don't kill me, please! Surprises are not what nice people do to other nice people, and I'm a nice person. Please, no surprises. Any keys? The beginning is faded, I can't read it. She's my little girl. We just want her back, Wilbur said in a tearful plea. According to the Wilbers, Christine was playing near the bushes towards the edge of the campsite. We called her for dinner, and she just wasn't there anymore. Police are looking at all possibilities. Wildcat attacks are pretty common in this area, said Sergeant Bailey. But her parents think that she was abducted. There was no bear or cat. We didn't hear any animals. Somebody grabbed her. Somebody took her from us. That's all it says. Well, I think I know who took him from you. I've seen him about five fucking times, and every time it didn't go well for me. I don't know where there are keys. Oh no, I heard footsteps! Or was that just running water? Just give me a fucking key so I can feel like I'm making some progress! God, I heard another door slam. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm pretty sure I'm fucking dead, man. I can walk through walls, you son of a bitch. Please, no. Just let me get a key. Just let me get one key! Where the fuck are all the keys? Well, this is so ass. God. I'm just walking around in circles right now. I have no idea where I'm going. Looks like a key! I couldn't see that at all! Oh god, that music. Ooh! Oh, another key! There's one more fucking key, man! Oh god, I hear shit. A key! Let's get the fuck out of here! Yes? I unlocked it! Yeah, you have to go in! What the hell's gonna happen? Oh god! Oh man. Please don't kill me. Oh god, it's just a straight hallway. You know what happens in straight hallways in horror games. Oh no, you can't go anywhere but straight. It's gonna be so fucking bad. Oh my god, it's gonna be the worst. Hey! Little girl- oh. Little girl, can you help me get out of here? No! No, I can't. No. No. Oh, why is the camera, like, tilted and shit? No, no, I don't want to help you get out of here. No! What is up with this fucking camera? I don't know where you are, guy. I'm just gonna have to leave you. I assume I'm gonna die. Oh, God. Looks like something at the end of that hall. What is that? Oh, shit! 
shit, no! No! No, run! 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 No, what the hell am I doing? Oh, no, what happened? Oh, man. Well, you know what? I found the three keys. I got through that door. I don't know what the hell's supposed to happen. I beat this game. It's done. I'm done. This is Ed Mundane. Thanks for watching, and have a good one. If you thought this video was cool, show some love and hit the like button below. If you want more, subscribe, and you'll get new videos every Wednesday and Friday. Share this video with your friends, and you won't have to buy them a birthday present this year. This has been Ed Mundane, and as always, thanks for watching, and have a good one. Spouting, splashing, soaking, innards and jest invoking, nailing never stops the choking. Maybe I've missed some stuff. Oh shit, what the fuck was that? Oh shit, oh shit.